you having you having them school, you having them teacher uh teacher flashbacks, man. School must have been Vietnam for your ass. God damn. <laughs> Like the school, they might, you know how school policies are. They always try to say like, but no, we already knew what the fuck was going on. Like, that's the thing about, that's the underlying factors that I hate about education systems and coming from somebody who actually dealt with that, who actually used to be a teacher. Like, you have to be a mandated reporter, but at the same time, like, I'm not no snitch and like, I can see everything. Like, if you're picking on somebody and I know somebody's going to have the edge, I'm not going to snitch on you. I'm going to be like, Go ahead and keep picking on him because when he fucked you up, I'm not going to say shit. I'm going to tell the TA and the instructional aide, don't say shit. His ass got mopped the fuck up. I'm not going to say shit. Grab my ruler, grab whatever the fuck you want to. Beat the hell out of him. I'm not going to give a fuck. But then us as educators, if we allow this to happen, like, that's me. That's me naturally. You want to keep doing all this shit? I'm going to let somebody fucking deal with you. Now you got dealt with. Now that parent wanted to have a fucking problem. Why did this happen to my child? Why? Because your child's fucking reckless. Because you're fucking, you have no fucking home training as a fucking parent. Yeah, you having some school system uh, flashbacks. <laughs> I got a lot of shit. That's why I say like, and that's the thing, like, I don't, I'm one of those where I understand like, I'm only going to give 5% to the person who you always go at, Mr. Hawthorne, only because, like, I deal with black kids. That's why I say, like, if you want to do all this shit, you can get loud. Like, I'm not going to deal with you. I'm going to let somebody else deal with you. You think I'm going to give a fuck? You're going to interrupt my shit? Go ahead and be the class clown. The call's already in. When you start seeing campus security, and when they start grabbing you, I'm not going to do shit. I'm going to say, hey, class Clap twice if you can hear my voice. Rub your belt. Let, let's do everything else. Nah, fuck him. He want to be the class clown. Who else want to join his ass? I'm one of those. You see, I'm going to make you the fucking example. All right, so he's getting the fuck out. Who else want to join him? All right, everybody clap twice. All right, now I got the fucking class's attention. Who else want to be a class clown? That's all it is. Because I'm not going to put my fucking hands on you. I'm going to let the school deal with you. you and then that goes back to right? I have my whole mathematics credential. I'm a whole, I'm registered to be a mathematics teacher right now. I'm on my, I have my whole credential. I already completed the 70 units. I was actually teaching in my parents' freaking school district before I got my job. I, I don't work in the school district anymore because I'm getting paid more because Actually, they don't pay teachers shit, just to let you know. Yeah, no, I see LA Unify on strike and shit over that. I'm not even, I'm not in that LA Unify. It's crazy to see that shit, because I was a kid when they had that last big strike and shit over, over pay or whatever it was. This back in the late 80s and shit. Eh. Like I say, like you having you having them school, you having them teacher uh teacher flashbacks, man. School must have been Vietnam for your ass. God damn. <laughs> nah, that's why I say, like, I just look at these are the children that you guys raise. Am I right? Y'all raise these badass kids that I can I can't put hands on. Campus security gonna put hands on. But this is what you guys raise, right? Your kids are taught to do this, right? Yeah, that's why I wouldn't get into teaching, man. Yeah, you're yeah, that's why I said you raise your kids to be like this when they're not around you. That's why you see all these comments going on. They know their children are badasses. They know that. They know that. They're not gonna be over there in the motherfucking PTA meetings and everything, parent teacher at. Oh, man, shut the fuck up. These parents ain't doing all that shit because you can look at what the fuck the seed is. Look at our fucking children today. Talking all renegade to motherfucking elders and everything, acting like they won't fucking sneak everybody. But this is what the fuck you raise, right? This is your educational system, right, Reggie? Right? Reggie? 
Nigga, don't, hey, don't be having a flashback on me, nigga. Shit. <laughs> no, I'm telling you, this is what the fuck we raised, though, right? See, that's the thing. Why don't we get a yes or a no? This is what the fuck we raised, right? But no, no, these kids is fucked up, man. That's why I wouldn't go into teaching. I will say this. As a person who was a teacher, I've never had a kid even think about squaring up on me. I don't know if it's the stigma of black people, but when you're 6'2", I don't think they really want to try to do all that shit. You know, that's why I'm like, I've never had anybody even try to do all that. But, you know, you always have your class plans and everything. I'm just like, all right, you want to do all that? All right. Hey, campus security, get this nigga the fuck up out of here. I said, get him the fuck up out of here. Who else want to join him? Because y'all all laughing. I know. Ha ha. Kiki. Who else want to join him? And then everybody else quiet. I'm like, all right. That's easy. I'm like, so this this was the main problem, and y'all shut the fuck up, like, bro, y'all that influence, y'all that fucking weak. This generation that fucking weak. Hey man, this isn't even what it was when I was even raised, but this is what the fuck we raised the weaker generations. Shit, debate about even having fucking kids. Yeah, no, it, it's crazy, but it was like that when we was kids. I know. We dealt no. with, I come up in the era of that single mama shit, and it'd be always the mothers wanting to fuck if a, if a teacher call home or they got, my don't you talk to my kid and this and that, and always don't talk to my child and my baby, man, fuck that. And they led to this shit. So now the kid got in their mind, oh, man, I'm going to always have my mom on my side. That's even almost how it was with the shit where, where that funny shit that set it off for, um, uh, What's the name turned into a joke? Kevin Hart, where he go to school, it's going to go down type shit. And he going back with a letter his mama wrote or what his mama said and repeat that shit. That shit was a joke, but that's kind of what set this kind of culture off with the school shit and the behavior of these kids. Even when I was a kid, and as I look back on, a lot of kids was fucked up. The fighting shit they'll start in school. Uh, uh, some of them do it because they want that attention. Some of them want the stigma of being the badass. They look, think the girls look upon them as being a cool. They're going to get, I don't know. It's a lot of reasons behind the stupid side of these kids, but it ultimately boils down to what these kids ain't being taught in fucking home. And and sure. I feel, like I say, I feel bad for fucking teachers in the school system because now you get the school districts who don't back these damn uh, teachers. And then you get parents that want to jump on because they think the lawsuit is is there for teacher to put hands on them. So now some of these teachers feel their hands are tied. They'll let your kid get his ass whooping in the, in the fucking school. And that I'll, tell you, I'll tell you one even worse, Reggie. I've even gone as much to say that certain people shouldn't even have fucking kids. Oh no! Certain people true. aren't. That's, certain that's people true. aren't responsible to have fucking kids. They're not responsible. They're like literally. Let's just be fucking honest. If we're gonna keep it all the way one hundred, certain people shouldn't even be having sex. They sh because look at what the fuck you're breathing. And this is, and that's why I say I'm gonna take it as they're gonna carry your name. This person doesn't represent me. Shut the fuck up, nigga. This came from you. Now it doesn't represent you. That's stupid. That's stupid. And that's what the fuck our generation came from. Let's be honest. I was born in the '80s, but I was raised in the '90s. Let's be fucking honest. This is the problem in society. People have the audacity to tell you what you can't do and what's wrong. Like, now if I'm beating the dog shit out of them just going overboard, yeah, kick my fucking ass and arrest me. But if it's a discipline thing, because a lot of these kids need to be addressed, then that's what it is. A school can't say none of that shit. School can't tell, can't tell you none of that shit. Half of these people yeah. working these schools be abusing their fucking kids. And that's true. And I'll tell you, I'll even go deeper, Reggie. Half the motherfuckers be preying on the motherfucking students too, nigga. And we seen it, nigga. Am I right? That's some real shit. We said shit. We hear them. That's what I said. Like, I I can tell you everything as a teacher that I've seen. Like, bro, are you fucking for real, bro? Even middle school to high school. Yeah, middle school to high school. Hey, if you can deal with elementary school kids and all that, why is that school? Once you get to middle school, elementary. Hey, I pray for you. I pray for your soul. 
because I've seen so many te teachers who I've even known. I'm like, dude, you're an o you're now in OCSD. You're now in the sheriff's department. Like, yeah. I've seen it. That's why I'm like, dude, I know what it is. Education, bro, this is, it's sad is what it is. This is why the whole education department, the whole education system is. So I, I do want to say like praises to your son. Um, a lot of things is, is Reggie, have you ever thought about uh, homeschooling? No, nah, fuck no. No, no, they cool. I like the school settings. Oh, go ahead, bro. No, no, no. You're good, Reggie. Uh, I just wanted to say those few things just because, uh, you know, me coming as a former teacher and then. As you already yeah, see, like you, with the, you got teacher, you got teacher trauma. Yo has <laughs> having a flashbacks in this motherfucker. <laughs> no, nah, I mean it, like, what, do the teachers got a VA system? I would call the teachers VA for your. We, we have a we have a we have a retirement system, but I mean like we don't. I mean, as in California, there's why do you think now all these teachers are on strike? You saw LAUSD and everything. Like teachers don't get paid. What the hell we have? What they have to go through? I'm no longer a teacher. Like. I would have loved to do it, but they don't get paid as much as they have to go through. And then yeah, you're subjecting true. these, you know, they're subjected to these renegade kids that can't put hands on them. They're talking all kinds of BS to me. Like, dude, they cussing teachers out. Like, that's the thing. Like, you can see everything on Twitter. Like, we can't do anything. Like, we got, and then at the same time, we got to be mandated reporters. We got to look over after you, even though you're cussing us out. Like, you're doing, like, that's and then it goes down to the parents. The parents feel like they're a one, even though the parents are pieces of shit. They shouldn't even have sex, have kids, like because they don't know how to raise people. Like people just think that oh, I just want a kid. Like they don't know how to fucking raise kids. You're not even responsible in yourself. But then you have this little one who doesn't even know what the fuck to do because you don't even know how to raise them. So it's just a whole bunch of people don't know what the fuck to do. Like, they really don't. And then when you leave it up to teachers, because that's what it is. It's in the teacher's contract. It's called being a mandated fucking reporter. We're told to look over your fucking kids. Recess, lunch, detention, all that shit. But you guys don't give a fuck. Your parents don't give a fuck. Your parents don't give a fuck. We got to watch over your kids for six and a half, seven hours. Six and a half to seven hours a day. But y'all don't give a fuck. Y'all don't. There's no tips here. No daycare here. Even though it is daycare with education. Y'all don't give a fuck. Y'all don't give a fuck. So don't even try to put that shit in the comments. Y'all some dog shit ass parents. Been dog shit ass parents. Or gonna continue to be dog shit ass parents. So that's all the fuck it is. Y'all some bitches. Straight bitches. It, this is straight from a teacher, man. <laughs> Y'all parents is out here fucking up and making shit hard on these teachers, goddammit. Finish letting them off, man. Go ahead and release your motherfucking anger, man. Tell these parents of uh, these scumbag-ass students. Reggie, 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 look at my background. What does that background look like in my background photo? That's a classroom, right? Explain it. Explain it. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can tell it's a classroom. Yes. So that is a classroom. That's Franklin Middle School. I have another one. I'm in front of a jackrabbit. Long Beach Polytechnical High School. I think that's what they call Long Beach Poly High School, right here off of PCH and Atlantic. 